Hello, and welcome to today's tutorial on pointing your domain to BrainHost. If you have a domain hosted with another web host, you can easily point it to BrainHost. Some reasons you may choose to point your domain to BrainHost rather than transfer your domain include your domain is out of the 60-day hold placed on new domains and recently transferred domains. You cannot transfer domains that are under this hold, but you can point them instead. You prefer to manage your domain through your current registrar, but want to host your website through BrainHost. In order to point your domain to BrainHost, you need to make sure of the following things. One, you have an existing domain name to point. Two, you access the domain through your registrar. And three, you have BrainHost name servers. Our name servers are, the first one is ns1dnsace.com, and the second one is ns2.dnsace.com. In order to point your domain to BrainHost, you need to change your name servers to BrainHost name servers, which was number one, ns1dnsace.com, or number two, which is ns2.dnsace.com. You do this through your current registrar. The process for doing this is different for every registrar. You should contact your registrar if you need help changing your name servers. For most registrars, you can log into your account and then look for your name servers in your DNS settings menu. Now, if you do not have a hosting account with BrainHost, if you do not already have a hosting account with BrainHost, visit http colon forward slash forward slash www.brainhost.com and click on sign up now. On this page, check the box next to update DNS and the transfer my domain box and enter the domain name you want to point to BrainHost. Then press the continue button to continue the sign up process. If you already have a hosting account with BrainHost, if you already have a hosting account with BrainHost, your first step is to log into your BrainHost cPanel. Remember, to log into your cPanel, what you're going to do is add forward slash cPanel to the end of your URL. For example, if your URL is www.mysite.com, you would get to your cPanel by going to www.mysite.com forward slash cPanel. Then go ahead and put your username and password in and log in. And when you log into your cPanel, you're going to scroll down here to domains, and what you're going to do is click on add on domains where it says new domain name. What you're going to do is enter the name of the domain you're pointing to BrainHost. For this purpose, we're going to use an example of test. And hit the tab key, and it's going to automatically fill out the rest of the information for you. Now in the document root box, what you're going to do is take out the public underscore HTML forward slash. You're going to go ahead and take that out of there. And the password, again, you're going to re-enter your password there. And then press add domain. Now on this screen, you'll see a message letting you know that your add-on domain has been created. Now next, you're going to contact your current registrar and have them change your name servers to BrainHost's name servers, which is ns1.dnsace.com and ns2.dnsace.com. After you point your domain, please note that once you change your name servers, it will take 24 to 48 hours for your name servers to propagate. During this time, you should not try to access your domain. Now to check to see if your name servers have been propagated, go ahead and visit forward slash forward slash www.dnsstuff.com. In the box labeled WHOIS Lookup, enter your domain name. Now on this page, you're going to scroll down and you're going to see the name servers for your domain listed. So go ahead and go down here. And we see right here. Now this one says ns1.dnsac.com and ns2.dnsace.com. Now if it does show this, you'll know that the name servers have been propagated and your domain is ready. If you see your old name servers, your domain is not yet ready. And that concludes our tutorial on pointing your name to BrainHost.